One of the most often overlooked areas on your Facebook page is the timeline cover photo. And what this is, is this is the area above your profile image. And what I often see people doing is either A, they're doing nothing, B, they're uploading an incorrectly sized image, or C, they're posting information they're not supposed to be including in a timeline cover photo. So we're gonna show you how to add a timeline cover photo. So what you wanna first do is go to your Facebook page and click on the add a cover button. You're gonna have two options here. One is the ability to choose a photo from your existing albums, or two, you're gonna be able to upload a new image. When you're uploading a new image, you wanna keep in mind the size of a timeline cover photo. The size is 851 by 315 pixels. If you happen to upload an image that's too small, it's going to stretch it out, it's gonna look disproportionate. If you upload an image that's too big, you will have the ability to reposition an image. However, I can tell you right now that that doesn't always give you the ability to show fans what it is that you wanna show them. So I highly recommend creating your image to the appropriate size. So now that we've uploaded a photo, let's show you how you can go in and change it. So we're gonna upload a second photo here. It's really simple. You just hover over the timeline cover photo area, select change photo, and you're gonna now have the ability to add a second image. And each time you upload a cover photo, they do get stored. So this way, if you wanna change them out, you can continuously do this. So one thing I do want to mention here is that in addition to uploading photos, you can choose a photo as well. So we're gonna select another photo. So as you can see here, this is a great shot. You know, if I were selling bicycles, this would be perfect. Um, one thing I do wanna mention though about timeline cover photos, you cannot include any sort of contact information in them. You can't include your social media links. You can't include website links. You can't do any sort of sales tactics. You cannot even sell the space. If you wanna include any of this information, you need to include it in the about section. So there you have it guys. That is how to add a timeline cover photo. So should you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. As always, Thanks for watching.